Hello guys, Crispy here and welcome back to another video. In this one, my friends, I'm going to be testing the RX 560 in Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 4, of course. I'm running the latest drivers from AMD, Adrenaline 2020 20.9.1. This one is the Sapphire Pulse version of the card and it's the 4GB model, by the way. I'm running it with a Ryzen 7 3700X and 16 gigs of RAM. You should be able to achieve the same FPS with something like a Ryzen 3 1200 if you overclock that and if you have dual channel RAM. 8GB is fine and we got a gift right now from Ms. played yeah yes let's just open that and thank you very much it's a dance i don't even know how to use dances but that's okay guys <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's go over the settings right now. I'm playing at 1080p resolution. I'm also going to be testing it at 900p and 720p as well. And I'm going to be using the competitive, medium and high settings throughout this video. I'm not going to do epic settings because epic settings with these uh, lower end GPUs doesn't really run very well. And I'm playing in DirectX 12, of course, because it runs way better than DirectX 11. So uh, I'm not going to go there, buddy. You know that the, the Whipping Woods is where it's at, my friend. Let's do this. At 1080p, if you want to achieve the same FPS as I'm getting right now, you will need something like that Ryzen 3 1200 overclocked, as I told you in the intro. But at 720p and 900p, you will need something a little bit better than that, because at the lower resolutions, you will be more CPU bound. So you put less strain on the GPU, and therefore it becomes more CPU demanding. So, okay, we're in the ground right now. Our boy has a pistol already. I'm gonna start counting our FPS. Uh, our boy is dead, unfortunately the game is kind of stuttering a little bit as you can see they're not very good experience to be honest but it's just the norm here in Fortnite I guess 1% lows are at 52 uh, they're stabilizing right now because as we progress into the match uh, it becomes less and less uh, stuttery I guess <laughs> maybe the new ray tracing option uh, actually kind of broke the game a little bit I don't know yeah another stutter right there well I'm just gonna tell you as it is you know let's get inside of a bush and and we're getting 60s not too bad so if you want to play this game competitively with the 560 you definitely can it's not gonna be a smooth high refresh rate experience of course it's far from it actually I believe the 560 was able to get a hundred plus in earlier seasons but now it's just impossible guys unfortunately and I totally forgot to grab that thing guys so I'm so sorry I, I just I spent way too much time there talking about stuff. <laughs> so yeah, 1080p with the low settings or competitive settings, which is pretty much the same thing, you know, you get pretty much the same FPS. It's just slightly more demanding at the competitive settings instead of uh, the um, low settings, of course. There we go. Okay, I hear him. I hear him. This is not good, guys. I, at least I am fully shielded up, you know. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, this is so bad. Oh my god. Oh my god. I am sucking too too much right now, guys. At least I got him. I'm gonna go ahead right now and stop the counting system. We got 99 FPS on average here at 1080p and let's do 900p right now. All right, so at 900p, you can see already that it's gonna be an extremely smooth experience. If you guys invested in a high refresh rate monitor to play this game, say for example in uh, chapter one, uh, season eight or season seven. Yeah, back then this game ran absolutely absolutely fine on the RX 560 even at 1080p with the low settings you could get like 150 plus FPS it was ridiculously well optimized and now it's just not really that well optimized of course at least it's not stuttering anymore right now it seems like the stutters have stabilized a little bit for the most part and to achieve these FPS that we're getting right now uh, like 120s to 140s you will need maybe a Ryzen 5 1400 because these actually utilizes more than four threads yeah I do think the Ryzen 5 1400 should be able to achieve these frames and that's still a very adequate CPU pairing for the RX 560 I will probably yeah I will just heal myself inside of this bush and see our FPS of course because bushes are very demanding and it drops from 100 FPS which is not a big deal guys this is still a high refresh rate experience um, I can definitely take advantage of my 165 Hertz monitor well not fully of course but it feels way smoother than 1080p resolution for example oh my gosh guys the circle is actually very far away as you can see it's stuttering a little bit more right there in the water not a big deal really this is yeah i could play this game all day with these settings right here no come on oh, you bastard oh 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 my god seriously dude come on you're outside of the circle you don't need to do this just let me be god damn it 
By the way, an update on the RTX 3080 that I went to buy to test here in the channel. Uh, I'm, I still haven't bought it because it's it's not on sale yet in Portugal for some reason, guys. It just sucks, you know. Okay, you know what? Let's stop it right there for 900p and let's do 720p right now. Am I dead? Am I dead? Okay, 1280 by 720 resolution, still the same competitive settings. Oh my god, how am I not dead? The guy was shooting at me with a sniper rifle. Seriously, seriously, how did you miss that? Anyways, if you want to get these FPS right now, guys... Uh, you will need a very beefy CPU, something like a Ryzen 3 3100 or... Uh, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on! God damn it, seriously! Uh, alright, pistol, okay. <laughs> Anyways, of course in the Whipping Woods it will be slightly more demanding, so our FPS will be a little bit slower, maybe into the 150s to 160s, but yep, you can see guys, if you have a strong enough CPU to handle up to 200 FPS in this game, you'll be absolutely fine. What am I doing? What is happening? Am I bugged out? Um, okay then, well, I just moved to the surface there for some reason. I have no idea what happened there, but these are really high FPS, guys. I'm taking full advantage of my 165Hz monitor with an RX 560, so th this, this is crazy. Okay, this is a little bit stressful, guys, not gonna lie, there's only five people left. How am I still alive? God damn it. There he is, there he is. Alright, did he see me? I'm not sure, guys. Did he see somebody else? Okay, yeah, he's fighting somebody else. Okay, no shields in that guy. And no shields in me as well. Why is everybody shooting at me? Come on! Oh my god! Alright, he knew exactly where I was. <laughs> Damn! And my friends, we're back here. 1080p medium settings across the board. As you can see, the exit 12 still. Let's do this. And from what we've seen at 1080p low settings, I really think that on medium settings, this GPU is not really capable of getting 60 plus all of the time. I think it will drop inside of bushes if it doesn't drop outside of them. Okay, here we go. There's quite a few people dropping here with us. So, um, let's start counting our FPS. Here we go, guys. I believe in the previous season we got, like, what, 80 FPS on average at the medium settings, which was insane compared to this. Uh, this has definitely become way more demanding right now. Um, okay, okay, he started building, so he's not a bot. God damn it. We got a gray from us. We got a gray from us. No, come on, I didn't pick it up. All right, I got this. I got this. Where are they? Uh, the mirror, please don't die yet. Please don't die right now. Okay, he got him. Of course, guys, if you are seeing higher FPS with your RX 560, it's just because you're probably not running around the whipping woods. As I told you, this is very, very intensive on the GPU, so your FPS are gonna get way lower in this general area right here. It's basically because of all of the trees and the shadows uh, and stuff like that. That's why it's a little bit more demanding as well on medium settings uh, than low settings. Please, Damir, help. Help me. Help me, the mirror. No, no. Oh my god. Oh no, I'm dead. Uh, there's another guy. I think there are two duos here in the whipping woods with us. God damn it, there are no weapons here. What the hell? Okay, there's an M4. I like M4. Okay. Inside of a bush, it drops into the mid to low 50s sometimes. It could be worse. It could be worse. Definitely. I didn't see the guy. Are you serious? Oh my god. Alright, he got him. Good. Oh my god. Good stuff, the mirror. You're the man. Well, or the woman, I don't know. Thank you very much, buddy. Oh my god, this guy was loaded. Okay, here we go, 69 FPS on average, pretty decent uh, experience still. If you have a 60 Hz monitor, it's fine. 900p right now, medium settings, let's do this. Oh my god, it's so much smoother right now, my friends. I can definitely tell the difference in, like, input latency as well as the FPS, the smoothness, you know. It's just way better, way more responsive. Yeah, I will definitely play at 900p with the 560. I think it's a 900p card nowadays. And the game does look way better this season than the previous one. So although we've seen quite a drop in FPS coming from season 3 to season 4, at least the game looks better. So, yeah, I guess I would still prefer the higher FPS, of course, no doubt about it, but, well, at least this time the performance dropped for a reason. <laughs> like, in previous ones it would stay the same and the performance would be worse anyways. What is it? What? What's happening here? What? 
What happened? <laughs> what, is, what are you trying to do? What are you trying to say? What is it? Oh, okay then. I don't like that thing. <laughs> Okay, so that might actually be enough for 900p with the medium settings. It runs pretty well here, doesn't drop from 60 FPS even inside of the bushes, so you can rest assured that in every other area of the map it's gonna be well above 60 FPS. 1280 by 720 medium settings across the board. Should we actually try to get these enemies, Demir? I I don't know, man. I don't know if that's a good idea. I'm not really feeling it too much. On medium settings, the anti-aliasing actually makes it look a little bit worse. Uh, it's all smudgy and soft looking, you know, it's blurry kind of. So I wouldn't really recommend if you are running like a 1080p monitor at 720p, just disable the anti-aliasing. It will look a little bit sharper and uh, you can spot people better that way in my opinion. Anti-aliasing doesn't really affect your FPS too much so I'm not gonna bother disabling that. Uh, the implementation in this game is not really performance hog, you know? Oh my god, okay, at least I hit him, at least I hit him! <laughs> oh gosh, okay, alright, no, no! Oh my god, I suck at this game so much I can't believe how bad I am sometimes. Ah, Demir, don't you go there! Demir, that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea, buddy. You're 2 HP. <laughs> right, okay. So he got my thingy there, and he can't really go revive me there, I guess. Anyways, guys, 720p runs perfectly fine at medium settings. We're now at 1080p high settings, as you can see. Let's drop in the Whipping Woods once again. So here on high settings, I'm not really too sure, but I don't think it's going to be a very smooth experience with the 570, at least not in the Whipping Woods. As you can see, as I turned around, uh, we're getting 35 FPS right now, and there's a ton of people dropping here for some reason. Oh my god, seriously, why? Why do people like the Whipping Woods so much these days? Let's start counting our FPS. It's not really going to get great FPS, as you can tell by now. It's in the 30s, it's probably going to drop into the 20s once we get inside of a bush, and I'm gonna try to do that right away, otherwise I'll die. It's already dropping from 30 though, so yeah, don't play on high settings. Unfortunately, it has become more demanding again this season. In the previous one, you could actually play like this absolutely fine. Now it's just dropping into the 20s, way too much for my taste. So I'm gonna disable those shadows right away at 1080p, guys. Okay, here we go, disabling the shadows will deliver us a very smooth gameplay once again, as you can see. Uh, yeah, inside of a bush 40s, outside of a bush 50s to 60s, not too bad. Really hope that people don't see me right now. My shiny beautiful skin doesn't really help me that much, but let's see. Okay, I'm gonna keep on moving right now again, buddy. I'm so sorry, if I go there I'm, I'm dead, so I, I prefer at least to end 1080p without shadows here on the high settings uh, before dying. <laughs> so bear with me, I'm so sorry again. I guess we're just being really unlucky, aside from the fact that that I suck at this game, obviously, but... Okay, there's a guy right there. I might just die with him so our boy can play again with us, my friends. He's, he's reviving him. He's revived. No, he heard me. I was really confident that he wasn't gonna hear me. Uh, yeah, that was a noob move, by the way. I, I suck at this game again. I told you. I told you. No. Oh, 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 okay, 40 FPS! 40 FPS fight, guys! It's not gonna go well for us because... Yeah, if I can't do anything with good FPS, let alone these 900p with the high settings, let's see if it becomes playable at this resolution now. Right, I'm gonna start counting our FPS, it's still dropping into the 30s, but I think it might be capable of doing 30 plus all of the time. So let's just keep on going and not give up on the RX 560. I don't, I would love to get that revolver by the way, but... Um, yeah, with these FPS, I'm not gonna do anything with that. Okay, okay, it seems like we are gonna go with a revolver, my friends. Revolver with 40 FPS is not an ideal combo, but let's see how I do right now, guys. At least we dropped the loan, so we might be able to do this. Inside of this bush right here, it drops into the 30s once again. Not bad at all. Okay, um... Right, this is this might be bad. It's not a bot because he was building way too much right there. I don't like this. I am not very feeling f confident right now. Please, Demir, you, you, you don't don't you die, Demir? Don't you die on me? Don't you dare dying on me? He died. He died on me. No, Demir. Why? 
Why? Okay, 900p high settings without shadows right now. I'm starting to hate the whipping woods. I loved the whipping woods for so long, but now, why? Why does everyone need to drop there and kill the Crespo? There he is. There's our next killer right there, guys. He's gonna get us, definitely. Look at him, just dropping like a pro, and I'm here with the stock fly thingy, whatever, the hovering... The, I, I don't even know the name of it! <laughs> well, guys, at least we are getting really good frames right now. It's way smoother. Uh, it's it's a 60 plus FPS experience, basically. I'm gonna go inside of a bush to see our FPS there. Uh, Alright, so it doesn't seem to be dropping from 60, which is good. Uh, okay, buddy, buddy, we need to be really careful. There's the guy right there. God damn SMG, mate! I almost died there! My boy spotted the guy right there, so no, 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 let's not go, let's not go! Come on, Demir, don't do that! You can see that it runs really, really well at the high settings without the shadows enabled. High settings with shadows enabled, however, it doesn't... Yeah, it's not really that smooth. 1280 by 720 high settings, as you can see, and here we go. Last resolution and settings of the video, aside from the shadows, you know, but yeah, let's keep on moving here. So we're in the 50s right now. It's still not enough for us to get 60 FPS with this GPU so it sucks to see because I believe in previous seasons the 560 would get 60 plus just per perfectly fine but not anymore guys you just gotta get used to this this is not the game that it once was it's not a really well optimized game whatsoever and if you want to play this competitively well you still can on the 560 but not at higher settings of course it's probably gonna drop into the 40s but not into the 30s inside of a bush uh, okay it doesn't even drop into the 40s I'm impressed with that, to be honest. I was expecting it to drop. Why Why am I taking this fight? I'm just... I'm, I'm gonna run away. I'm gonna run away because that's the best thing I can do. Look at our VRAM utilization, by the way. 2.7 gigabytes at 720p. So that's quite a bit too much. God, oh God. No, the mirror. God damn it, dude. God damn it, dude. Okay, let's stop it right there. 1% lows are pretty respectable right there, guys. Not gonna lie. Pretty decent stuff. And let's just disable the shadows right now. Disabling the shadows gives us, what, like 20, 30 more FPS, which is kind of impressive. Our boy is dead. Not sure if it was the enemies. Or oh, 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 my god. No way. No, 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 no. I need to get into another one to test 70. Okay, yeah, perfect. This is amazing. Alright, let's count our FPS, my friends. It's above a hundred, which is pretty good, and the game is kind of looking decent, to be honest. Even at 720p in my screen, which is a 1440p monitor, yeah, it's it's not looking bad. The NTL is on high settings, it makes things soft, but it doesn't make them too blurry. At least not to the point that it I, I would call it distracting or unplayable-ish. Okay, we got a bush right here. Very, very nice. Alright, here we go. So inside of a bush, 70s, pretty good. Right, so there are two squads fighting each other right there, I, I think. Um, okay, okay. Should we do this, guys? Should we do this? I'm gonna go for it. I don't even care. Let's go, Damir. We can do this, I believe, right now. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm here. Where is he? Where is he? There? Uh, oh, there he is. Okay, then. I'm gonna try to do this from here. All right, there we go. No, no, okay, okay. No, 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 I'm missing everything right now. Oh boy, okay, the mirror got them all. Great stuff, my friend. So I guess that's been it for this video, my friends. The RX 560 still has what it takes to play Fortnite, of course. Uh, just not as well as it did, but it's still a very playable experience. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope it was informative for you. I'll hopefully see you in the next one. And as always, I love you all. Bye-bye.